Hello everyone, it's just me, Johnny. Chris Bo Video speaking. Here is a fan defense about to Black Buster's response to Barney. Barney the dinosaur is so special right here on the earth. And I even went to him when I was a little kid. And I even went to dance, sing along, and read books, and many more. But why do you think Barney haters don't like Barney for some reason? Like, they sing the I Hate You song and killing Barney. I don't even like that at all. Children still are buying from this point on today, and they still do. In fact, I even have this Barney doll that I got for Christmas. The Backyard Game doll. The first half of Barney doll produced. I don't get to see the series very often. Like the ones from seasons 10 to 13 and all that, because I didn't get the chance to work at them yet. But, I do see one episode that I really liked was that we kill a dragon from season 12. The part with Whip chasing the dragon away was so funny. And I could have stopped laughing when I saw it on TV. But there was one other thing about the Barney and Friends. What do you think about Barney? Does you think about his voice, his talent, his sing along, dancing, or other? Just put a comment on my comment box and I'll explain the rest of it later. And I do happen to say this, but I do have one other question. And this is to Black Blaster. Why do you think Kids still like Barney from this point on today. Um. Let me see. Um, Barney is so special because he loves everyone, including all of you. And I even really like Barney as well. But. Some Barney hairs say that we hate Barney and we like to kill him. But I don't like the sound of that at all. And I don't even like when they say bad words about Barney. Like, um, Barney, you're a piece of crap. Barney, you're a damn piece of shoot. And I would tell the Barney hairs to get out of the way and run the damn freaking away. Sorry about that, but I'm just making that up. And I even do have Barney stuff in Spanish and Hebrew. Like, Musical Castle, Nomos Nomos, and Red, Yellow, and Blue. And the Hebrew version of The Treasure of Rainbow Beard the Pirate. But what do you think was wrong with Barney when his first movie came out, like Barney's Great Adventure? It was a success for the movie theaters. And I even really liked it. But why did they nominate Barney for two awards, awards like the Barney song and Barney himself? What do you think was wrong with that? Barney's not a worse dinosaur. He's so special. And I even really liked him even more. <sighs> and I only got a few more minutes left to go. But I'll catch you later though. Just for a quick update about the fan face video for Black Buster's response. About Barney's Great Avenger. Barney's okay though for his first movie, Barney's Great Avenger, the movie. It was a great adventure. Like when they chased the egg through all the way out throughout the movie. And I really like the part when it had some incidents like like the plane crashed into a haystack. But luckily, the kids were all right though, and so did Barney. And Cody returned the egg where he had found it, at the barn, at his grandparents' house. Now, on to Barney concert stuff. Barney's first concert was in 1991, 
in Dallas, Texas at the Mac Jackson Theater. The show was all right though, but it didn't take any breaks. But in Barney Life in New York City, they took a break in the first half of the show and on to the second half of the show. But in that concert where they perform in New York City, they didn't sing the I Love You song because of the lawsuit over the song occurring in 1994 that the Parker shows that Lee Burstein's book sued the Lions, Barney's owner, J.C. Penny, and Time Wife for a lawsuit. But of course, the Lions group, now known as Hit Entertainment, made a settlement with Bernstein back in 1992. And also, Barney's Imagination Island and Barney's Favorites Volume 2 album didn't have the song either. Likely for the same reason because of the lawsuit in 1994. However, in Barney Celebrate's Children, the I Love You song was sung finally after the lawsuit ended in the same year. Well, during the talking part with Barney's owners, I noticed that I saw the treehouse and the classroom set for season three. Well, on the Barney Celebrate Children's Special. As a matter of fact, they changed Barney throughout the years. Like, when Barney was a blue violet color, to magenta or pink, whatever it is. And now, and I too have some other fan to face. Um, t Thomas the Tank Engine was the number one boot train on the island of Sodor, with all of his friends. I got to see the old seasons in the restore format, but, one other thing though, why do Thomas fans hate Thomas the Tank Engine? No, 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 wait, wait, wait. What is it? Why do Thomas sayers hate Thomas more than Barney? Was it because Thomas was changed from TV series model into a CGI computer program? Or, or is it because of his voice? Or is it, is it um, let me see, of his fiend tomb, whatever it is. Put a comment on my video, right beside here, and I'll explain it to you later on. Now, for Sonic fans, my brother really we liked Sonic for a very long time. He played a Sonic games like Super Smash Brothers, the original Sonic games for the Sega Genesis, the Antenna Wii, and many more. Gee, one other question though. Why do Sonic haters hate Sonic so much? Is it because of his speeding so fast? Because he doesn't do very good, or is he doesn't do other stuff very well? Put a comment right here on my video, and I'll explain it to you all. That's it for right now, from Jeremy Crispo, and a response to Blackbuster's video challenge. Catch you later!